Hello ladies, it's Amber from usedpantysellingadvice.com and lacenewface.com here today to discuss uh, or advise a little along the lines of the message that selling used panties is easy money and how I feel and other people feel that that might be a bit of a myth <laughs> and to offer some words otherwise from a seller's perspective. See. I don't know if you ladies have done any researching on the internet yet about how to sell used panties, but there are a few websites out there that say it's easy mon money, and um, without providing any context of who it is writing this information, but that's besides the point. I would like to add a little disclaimer here that I'm not intending on attack attacking any specific individual with... Um, communicating what I feel to be myths. It's just that um, as this, as far as this is concerned, telling people that selling panties is easy money might attract certain types of people that um, generally aren't really welcome in the online niche. Uh, people who by, might be more of a turn and burn mentality and um, not really focused on the end product or their relationships with their buyers. That's really why I'm doing this. Is I want people to know, or ladies to know, that selling panties is not easy money. And I'm going to link below to an interview that I just posted on usepantyselllingadvice.com. It was from a young lady named Tina, Miss Tina's Panties.com. And I had posed the question in the interview, is selling panties easy money, as some may think? She says, definitely not. I spend a lot of time emailing, taking pics, filming videos, arranging pretty photo sets, writing thoughtful thank you cards, organizing orders, and not to mention panty shopping and trips to the post office. It takes a lot of time and attention to detail to prepare a great panty order and keep it up for any length of time. And what she means is do one after the other. So I am uh, revealing Tina's interview in the section in it because I feel that having another voice in this is, is important, number one. And number two, she actually has a, a broader view than I do of all of the potential facets of this online niche. I have been primarily a purely independent seller with my own site, um, not really relying on any outside um, entities to help me along, whereas she has spent a, a little bit of time um, on a venue. So I thought that that would be of a little more value. But anyway, if you would like to read the rest of her interview, again, I linked to it below. And I just really would like ladies to know that this, anything that will make you money will take time. And if ever there is a message otherwise, I would just question um, the source. Kind of look beyond the surface information and uh, read a little bit deeper into it. Thank you. Come back for more use panties for 11.